Well, hello everyone and welcome back to Subsistence Land. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> uh, confession time. I uh, screwed up a recording, so it basically it wasn't all that exciting. It was essentially a loot day. I, I don't like losing time, losing episodes and stuff like that, but it, it wasn't really all that exciting. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, but uh, I can tell you that we never did get a visit by uh, Alpha. They didn't come by. And what I can tell you is my feelings from that were hurt. Um, I, 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 I aggroed them. I, I did. I, I'm pretty sure that they saw me and they just disrespected me. They, they've, they basically have decided that I'm not worth their time. And uh, I think... I think that that needs needs to be called out. Now, the one thing... Oh, that's right. Oh, I'm not going to show you what I... Oh. I did kill a moose. <laughs> Oops. Oh, well. What we could do is we'll save the... We'll save the roast ribs and vegetables for uh, the... For uh, post... The post... Uh, sort of episode of going after those guys. Now... Uh, I'm going to use uh, a, a grenade-tipped arrow. So we're going to need one of you. We're going to need to make a... Uh, basically, we're going to need to make a premium arrow. So I'm going to need premium feather, crystal, scrap, and... Uh, let's see. Premium feather, uh, crystal, uh, scrap, and it was something else. What was it? Uh, iron. Iron frag. There we go. Actually, you know what? Let's make five. Let's make five. Just, if we're going to make them, let, let's, let's make it worth our while, right? Uh, we've got a bit of, uh, we've got a bit of stuff that we've sort of been storing. And I think I should have enough crystal. Yeah, I think we can spare enough to make five uh, premium arrows. I think that's, that's, no, not you. We're going to make five of you. Okay. And then to make the grenade tipped arrow, I'm going to need a couple of cordage. One, two, and we're just going to make one grenade tipped arrow just for getting in the door. Oh, yeah, I'm just going to hold that on me. And <clears throat> I think that's a good idea. Now, also, the grenade tipped arrow is not going to take any mass. Neither is this. So I think what we'll do is we're going to make a uh, we're going to make a lock pick just so that we have one on us. Uh, just for for it incidentals, possibilities. Uh, one, two. Okay, there we go. I just feel really bad, by the way. I feel bad for uh, the, <laughs> for you know, like missing missing out on some stuff. But it happens every once in a while. I kind of, I just screw up. It's remarkably easy to do. Uh, you know, <laughs> it just it happens. So uh, we're gonna we're gonna do a we're gonna do a base uh, a base attack in uh, as a as a consolation. I think that's probably a good idea. Okay. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, I need you in my inventory. Okay. There we go. So we've got ourselves a grenade-tipped arrow coming in. We're going to have... Uh, well, I'll also grab these. So we're going to have four premium arrows, and we're going to have a grenade-tipped arrow. Yeah, we're going to put that away. Uh, what is the um, biofuel situation in here, anyway? It's 40. Nice. That's actually really good. Let's grab you. You. Nothing in here, right? No. Uh, I'm going to keep a couple of waters on me for washing my hands, because that is useful. Look at that. 115 biofuel. Eh, it's not... You know what? We've been doing really good with biofuel lately. Maybe because of all the wolves we've been killing and stuff like that. Now that I think about it. Oh, and I've started taking to um, making... Carrying a heat pack around with me. Just in case we get caught out in a... Um, uh, whatchamacallit? In a snowstorm. And the other thing I'm going to do is I am going to take... I'm going to wear a uh, the vest for this. The weather is really nice out today. If it looks quite sunny, I think we'll be fine. Uh, just to just to increase my odds my uh, of, of basically surviving this situation. All right. Let's double check. We've got a few arrows. We've got some uh, premium arrows, grenade-tipped arrows. You know what? Let's switch over to the premium arrows right now. Not the grenade-tipped arrows. So we're going to we're going to switch over to these guys. Uh, the, the premium arrows with this level four bow uh, does 144 hit points of damage. The grenade-tipped arrow with this level four bow does 360 damage. 
So, yeah, it's not insignificant. Um, <laughs> it's pretty darn good. All right, and then we've got some uh, SVT ammo. Okay, I think we're in good shape. So let's go after, let's go after Bravo. They, uh, this disrespect shall not stand. Ooh, loot. Of course, I'm going to get distracted by loot on the way. Uh, there's another crate over there. Ooh, and some fiber. We need that. <laughs> and there's a crate over there. Oh, for crying out loud. Uh, no. Yes. That's, it might have scrap in it. Oh, there's scrap too. Oh, game, you're killing me. You really are. You're really... Okay, okay. If, if, yep, see, look. One scrap. And two scrap. If we didn't come over here, we would be down two scrap. That's like half of a, uh, um, whatchamacallit. Half of a, uh, a lockpick right there, right? In scrap. So, that's like enough scrap for two... That's cool. Uh, two premium arrows. Huh? And look at that. Minus one degrees. I think we're... So we're good as far as temperature is concerned. Even though we're wearing our... Um, there we go. We're wearing our... We are wearing our lovely sweater. It's blue. <laughs> but we are also wearing body armor. So I think we're in reasonably good defensive position. Yeah. Uh, once we take care of them, you know, if we can just get back to the base with some loot and stuff like that, we can always swap the jacket back on. No, Wolf, I'm not interested. We've... No. No. I saw the lock crate that you were guarding, and I am not going to take your bait. Oh, and... Is this... Is Ruprecht up here? No. Is Larry up here? No. <gasps> no. 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 By the way, just so you know, I had a moment of weakness, and I fell off the, uh, the, the, the loot train. The loot, instead of the loot bandwagon, I fell off the loot train, and I, and I started gathering. It was very bad. It was, oh, there's a white wolf up there, too. Um, you know what? Hey, wolf. Come with me. Come on. Oh, scrap. Of course, I could probably... It, I don't know where the hunters are. I might be drawing there. Oh, man, I missed! Oh, that sucks! Oh, that hurts! It actually kind of hurts a little bit. Oh, God. All right. But I wanted to pull that wolf away. Because, uh... Yeah, I don't want to... I don't want to get harassed by a wolf when we're going after these guys. I, I know we can use them against... Oh, my God. There's a little box there. I know we can... We can use the animals against them, but we're just going to keep it as simple as possible. All right. What I'm a little confused by is the fact that I'm not seeing any hunters. There's a dude up on the balcony, and he seems to be agitated. Got him once. Okay, one's over there by that tree. Oh, crap! Reload! Reload, oh no! Seriously! Okay. All right. All right. Not bad. Okay, we've got two. I'm going to use a bandage just because. All right. That's a pistol, so I think we're good. But he's going to switch over to the SVT in a second, and that's bad. Oh! Ho, 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 ho. One more bandage. There we go. Okay. Are we quiet? We're good? All right. Eh! I, I rate that as a mediocre, uh, that was, that was not really my best work, but it was fun. <laughs> I enjoyed it. Okay, let's see. Where is the, sometimes the, where, it should be easier to spot in this weather.
There it is. Okay. All right. Are we ready? Oh, I should have tried. Oh, I, this was a terrible uh, uh, opportunity. I should have used. No, not that. <laughs> I should have used the uh, premium arrows against the hunters. That was very uh, wasted. Okay, We're, but that's okay. We're going to use it against the guy inside. There we go. So that was a fair amount of damage. If we note, there is... Yeah, we're down to 140. Oh, by the way. Let's get this. Okay. All right. Uh, 140. This won't take too long, so I'm not going to cut away for this. Um... <clears throat> so that one grenade-tipped arrow does a significant amount of damage to the door. Uh, and, you know, that's the, that is the amplification that is done by the level 4 bow. That's, that is nice. That, I, I will say, that actually is really, really nice to, 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 oh, that makes a big difference. Um, all right, all right, enough, enough gushing over the, uh, the uh, level 4 bow. It's, um, yeah. <laughs> Uh, let's let's see now we should have somebody else in fact what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch over to the premium arrows there we go and we're gonna go use a pre we're gonna use a premium arrow against the hunter in the base now I've never used a bow on a uh, base entry like this so this is gonna be kind of interesting it's gonna be a little awkward I'm not gonna lie uh, it's gonna be a bit a bit weird and a bit awkward so Hey, did you notice that I've got 80% uh, campfire bonus and my health is now back up to 100% and I'm feeling good? These hunters have kindly lit a fire inside so that for my comfort while I break down their door. You know, just when I... I, I just... Alpha, I just can't get mad at you, Alpha. I just can't. Can't get mad at you. And thanks for the stuff. <laughs> nice. Okay. <laughs> Let's get that. Um, there we go. Nothing on the first. This is the small, smallest base of the of the lot. <gasps> Eleven. Oh, that is so nice. Look at that. We can even have them do a bit more copper. In fact, I'm going to come back for that. So let's free up a, a storage slot. And also, oh no, we can't eat that. But we can eat. It's, no, 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 we've got rack of ribs we're supposed to be saving room for. Don't spoil your dinner. Oh my God. Okay, I'm a little concerned about the inventory management. Actually, you know what? I think we're going to be fine. Three ingots, that's nice. Padded cloth, oh. Um, oh, and also we've got boards. The only thing is the, uh, oh, and a grenade. You know what? We're going to eat you. And we're going to take the grenade because that is high priority. Uh, we can basically convert the uh, the medicinal plant into biofuel. And so that'll grab the uh, that. And then we can convert the cordage into, or the, the fiber into cordage. And then that'll give us space for that. All right. Okay. I think that's it. We've got everything. Grab you. Uh, we're going to let that cook. And we're going to go back to the base uh, switch over to our winter clothes and uh yeah oh i can't i can't harvest i can't loot we've got oh that white wolf is back mind your own business wolf oh medicinal plant i can't grab you either i can't kill the wolf it's got loot too ah. <laughs> oh well oh i got a quest you know what let's test something so um, the wolves will run away if you, uh, go on to, like, a, you know, a player-made thing. But does that count if it's something that's slightly below the ice? Wait, 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 what just happened? Oh! I don't have the space for what I was... Okay, okay. Here's the test. Watch this. Don't, he doesn't see me, does he? Okay, no. It, the ice, I think... I think the ice didn't do what I think it did. That's interesting. 
that is actually really kind of interesting. Yeah, I was while I I forgot that I didn't make room for something, and uh, yeah, so that's fine. We're just gonna empty some inventory here and go back and see if we can pick up the stuff that we, uh, that we that we dropped accidentally. Uh, let's get you and what else? Anything? No. Well, probably, but I didn't see it, so uh, not you. Uh, that. That. Oh. Oh, we've overflowed on zinc. Yeah, we'll just shove it there for now. Put that away. Uh, got a bit more glass. That's super valuable. Um, the padded cloth is nice as well. We've got a bit of mass. And uh, that is also mass, so that's kind of nice. And that is mass. And we got a what? We replaced the grenade that we used to break down their door. Oh, oh that's sweet. Oh, that's so good. Okay, and we've got a bit of mass here, and a fuel brick. How's the fire? Oh, man. Okay, well, um, let's make another fuel brick. And put away the rest of our stuff. Let's see. We'll keep the, uh, we've got the medicine like this here. Oh, and biofuel. Do 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 Alright, let's head out. Let's head out. Uh, how's my health? How's my everything? Good enough. Alright, let's go see. You know what? No, let's go and retrace our steps and see if we can find any boxes that we left. They're probably despawned. Yeah, they prob yeah, yeah, yeah. That's okay. That's all right. I, it's a little bit of a bummer, but that's what happens when your inventory overflows. All right. Um, that's fine. We can... Uh, the, the upside is, number one, I forgot to swap out my vest, so we're going to freeze to death. Um, and number two, uh, we get a little bit of extra space to loot. And we also get to deal with a white wolf that's been harassing us forever. <sighs> Buddy. Actually, we gotta reload that one pistol bullet first. Oh, I didn't, didn't actually do it. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Switch back over to the regular arrows and let's go take a look at our white wolf friend. Because he's just gonna become, a, he's just gonna be a pain. What are you, 120? 113 hit points? Oh, you're a single shotgun shell. Come here. Come here. Come here. Yeah. That's what you get. Yeah, see, I'm starting to get cold. Getting chilly. All right, let's go and um, double check on our refine stuff, and then we'll get do a little bit of looting in the area. Uh, we'll pick up the ash from the fires, like you, and like grab that, and I think that's all we got in here. We did get the fat. Yeah, I figured we did. Okay. I just had a thought. It's snowing, which is the winter equivalent of rain, and that fire is not going out. So that new mechanic that will snuff out a um, will snuff out uh, the fire in if campfire if it's unprotected in rain apparently not all pre uh, precipitation is created equal <laughs> apparently campfires uh, will uh, don't get snuffed out by snow I did not know that I did not know that <laughs> is that another white wolf Oh, for crying out loud. Here. I'm going to get that fiber. Yeah. Mind your own business, Wolf. Not interested in your shenanigans. Do, 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 do. It's a very chilly day. All right. And there's the wind. You hear that? That's the uh, that's the that is the bad bad weather, not just the bad weather. In fact, you know what I'm gonna do? I don't. I'm not gonna come back here. So let's grab all of that. We've used up some of the you know we've used up some of their resources. 
I'm feeling pretty good about that. And that campfire is about to go out anyways. You know what? Let's go and... Here. Just for... Oh. Okay! <laughs> well, all right then. Oh my goodness. Iron. Yep. I fell off the... Uh, no, it's potassium. Okay. I fell off the... Uh, my ore, my ore, oh my god, another white wolf. Uh, my ore avoidance schedule. Hush. Hush. Stupid wolf. And I'm running out of stamina because it's super cold because I forgot to swap out my jacket. Well, that's okay. We, we got what we wanted done. Um, we're just doing a little bit of light looting uh, on the way, you know, back from between the uh around the base around them in fact what i might do uh is yeah you know what let's let's loot uh let's chop trees um we do need them and if i were to give myself just a little bit of protein that might help with the uh, stamina situation maybe not <laughs> we'll keep an eye on the health and stamina but i think Basically going and gathering trees, I think, is going to at least give us a little bit of stamina back. And we'll get some wood, work our way back to the base. I'm not going to worry about getting frostbite, even though my hands are all bloody. Ah, here. I'll tell you what, buddy. How's this? Make your hands all wet in the snow. There you go. In the, in the, driving, the driving wind, now you've got wet hands. It'll make the frostbite happen just a little bit faster. Yeah. Yeah. You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs> do, 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 do. All right. Get some wood. How we doing? Not bad. Hmm. I'm just the. I'm. I'm just right now. I'm just thinking about the roast ribs. The rack of ribs. That's that's where my mind is. So, yeah. Because, you know, cold, hungry, frostbite. Do we see it on his fingertips yet? No? <laughs> God, he's like, dude, you're, you're just a jerk. That's what you are. <laughs> he's like, <laughs> some, some, yeah, he's getting, you know, brain aneurysms from suffocating uh, under the eye, underwater. Um frostbite from being forced to be out in uh, driving snow after mi washing your hands to get wolf blood off of them. This guy, I tell you, he lives the life. He's living the dream. He's living the dream. The, the subsistence dream. <laughs> oh, my health is dropping. Yeah, okay. We're actually, all jokes aside, I am going to have to get back and, and warm up a little bit because this is... I am not... I mean, I'm not far from my base, but... But if I let my stamina drop too much, yeah, you see what's happening here? I'm not even running, and it's dropping as I'm walking. Look at that. And my health is dropping. So it could have gotten really bad if I didn't, uh, if I wasn't careful. So, And if, if something came at me right now, like a wolf or something, yeah, I'd be dead meat. Unless I could draw my weapon fast enough. Here, we'll have the bow out. We'll scare them out. We'll scare them away. Whoa! There we go. Let's get in here and warm up. And put on our, our warm winter jacket. There we go. Much better. <sighs> and, nope, oh, we're not going to eat yet. Not going to eat. Okay. Okay. There we go. Let's put away some stuff. Uh, how are we doing for... Oh, we've got two piles of copper, too. Wow, I really am going to have to... You know, I might actually... We've, we've been burning through a lot of iron. I might have to switch... Um, I switch the mining drills over to iron. Yeah, in fact, I think I'm going to do that. Because we've, we've, we're, we're doing well with... Um, we're doing well with the, the, the zinc now. Uh, so I think that's a good idea. In fact, you know what we're going to do? Here, we're going to grab that. We're going to grab a bunch of you, and we're going to grab that, and we're going to make these. There we go. We've still got 43 left, so that's nice. And... 
<clears throat> I think what we're gonna do is we're not gonna we're, we're we're gonna have to defend ourselves from an attack tomorrow in the in game, and so we're not gonna basically we're not gonna we're not gonna do it tomorrow. But I'm gonna prep for uh, doing a <clears throat> an extended underwater dive um, and stuff like that. So we're gonna start making. Oh, I need more zinc. We're gonna start making some tanks. I think that's a good idea. Right? I think that's awesome. And then, <clears throat> what we're gonna have to do... Oh my goodness, hang on a sec. What we're gonna have to do is we are going to have to um, make ourselves a spare axe because, well, you know, getting out of the ice, in and out of the ice, it takes an axe, right? So, and uh, that axe, I don't think it's going to survive um, too many more attempts at carving up the ice. So we're going to make ourselves a nice little axe as well. Uh, we're going to need another pickaxe because, you know, the hitting clams and sandstone does cost stuff. So let's take a look. We need another uh, four, four, and two of you. We've got the cordage. Okay, that's fine. But we're going to take four of you and four of you. And we're going to make another pickaxe. Go. And yeah, I think one and a half pickaxes should be fine. Um, should I do it? No, no, we've got the... If I'll tell you what. If the attack tomorrow is soon enough, then we will uh, we'll, we'll do the, the... You know, actually, screw it. Let's just do it anyways. It's just alpha. I don't really care about their attack. It's not... If they do it while I'm here, great. If not, I'm not going to stick around for them. You know, they disrespected me. I'm going to... I'm going to dis disrespect them right back because they don't deserve any more than that from me. Yeah. I think that's good. Um, let's grab... What? A bunch of carrots? Six carrots. That's fine. And... No. Let's grab a bit of water. And we go take care of the animals. Hey guys, how's it going? Wait a minute. Oh, there's two of you. Okay. Whew. Oh, I thought that uh, I thought they went missing. And we're gonna switch this over to iron. There we go. And get a little bit of ice or a little snow. What? Oh, there we are. Now we're in it. Do, 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 do. It's gotten really quiet. <laughs> it's all of a sudden gotten very quiet. It's kind of a nice, uh... It's kind of nice ambiance, actually. Did I grab some... I didn't. I did not grab the manure. Might as well get that. Use it. There it is. 65. Yeah, it's pretty good. Do, 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 do. How much water do I have? Two, four, six. Nope, I need more. Oh, I think some of the plants have actually uh, probably matured as well. <gasps> That's right. Okay, we only fertilize these ones. That one's not done. That one's not done. Uh, this one's not done, but it needs water. And this one needs water. But it, I think the, those potatoes, these might be done. Yes. Let's take a look. Yep, they're done. Okay. So let's, um... No. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Oh, what the hey. Let's just do it anyways. All right. And we're going to basically do a combo of potatoes and cotton. Because... What you don't know is yesterday I got a lock crate and I got a boatload of cotton uh, seeds. So we're going to grab uh, one of... There we go. And just to, so we have the uh, the full eight back up, uh, we're going to put that there. And then we're going to go... There we go. Cotton and potatoes. Nice. Okay. Uh... You know, I wonder, vegetables 10, vegetables 12, vegetables 8, and vegetables 22. Tomatoes really are very efficient when it comes to the fruits and vegetables. Hunger 17, 
Hunger six, hunger four, and hunger four. Yeah, I think when it comes to feeding the animals, it's between carrots and tomatoes. And I think I'm going to stick with that. All right, let's get a bit more of the water. Oh, before it gets light, we should check to see where the, the, where the uh, rogues are. Uh, we're going to do a dive, so it's not really a big deal. But here, let's, let's turn the lights out because it's going to get light in a second. Uh, but it, it, it would be nice to know if we pop out somewhere if we're going to run into any major trouble. Okay. Oh, there we go. All right. Let's take a look. Okay, so... Ooh, that's not far from where my old base used to be. So there are... Uh, there's rogues up there at the head of the thing. So we'll have to be careful because we may pop up over here. And they could be down at the lake just sort of milling about. I wonder if the rogues go ice fishing. Do the hunters go ice fishing? <gasps> I don't know. That would be cool if they did. That's kind of interesting. There's like a little... Oh, no, it's gone. It's like an artifact. All right. They're okay. They're way... Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is that is at the top of the valley. So there's ro uh, rogues at the top of the valley. There's uh, one rogue right there. That's me. <laughs> yeah. Top of the lake, top of the valley. Okay. Good to know. Yep. I think that's it. That's all I see. Cool. Well, all right then. Let's see. Um, wow. That was actually really efficient, taking care of all the the, uh, the water and the plants and stuff. It's still dark. What the heck? I've fed the animals. I've... Oh. Well, okay then. Uh, I guess what we can do is let's just double check and see whether we how many of these guys we have. We have 28 masks, so we could make one more. So we'll have six. I want to have... You know what? I'm going to... For insurance purposes, I want seven. So we need a couple more of you. And a, uh, oh, I probably I did have some portage on me already. We're going to make one more um, tank. There we go. And put that away. And we, oh, we have 14 zinc on us. Yeah, right, right, right. Put that in there. Okay. There we go. So we've got a spare axe for cutting through the ice. We've got a spare pickaxe for uh, going after the sandstone. Um, we have... I'm going to just take the dive gear right now. We've got dive gear and seven. Yep. We've got seven. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven tanks. So hopefully that's going to be enough. The last thing I want to do is we're going to do celebratory. That. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's very, very good. So tasty and wonderful. You know what? I am going to take a couple of uh, water bottles with me and uh, refill. Here, let's refill this uh, canteen. Do, 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 do. All right, we're expecting an attack from our neighbors. Um, you know, I might actually, uh, no, no, no. I might just temporarily just uh, dump this out in here, just in case if we do get into a fight with them, I don't want to lose half my air tanks. I want to still be able to, to do the dive with all those air tanks. And if we, yeah, we could lose half our stuff if I somehow die in the attack of when, when Alpha comes over and attacks. They, and they'll probably do it in the over the ice. So we'll give them a chance in the morning to, to get their little butts in gear and get over here. But uh, that's going to be next time. So until next time. Oh, well, thank you very much, by the way. <laughs> thank you, everyone. Until next time. You all have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye.